Hello fellow congregants, L'Shana Tova from Ellen and our family, and welcome to Elul. First, an ancient Midrash. The angels in heaven looked out their window, saw the new moon and three stars, and realized Rosh Hashanah was starting. So they set up the heavenly court as they do every year. But God suddenly turns to them and says, as my grandmother used to say, Vusidus, what's going on? Take down the court. It's not Rosh Hashanah until the humans say it's Rosh Hashanah. They have been commanded and blessed with the job of sanctifying Rosh Hashanah, not us. The sages in this Midrash were reminding us that the date of a holiday on a calendar is not the focus of where the true meaning is found. We must, as a community, make the day special by sanctifying and celebrating the day as community, even more so this year as we deal with our social isolation. And like any important celebration, we need a period of planning and anticipation that precedes it. How would a wedding work out if the banquet hall is chosen and the announcement and invitations are sent out on the morning of the affair? For Rosh Hashanah, the preparation is the month of Elul, with shofar, special prayers and readings, inward reflection, seeking of forgiveness, and teshuva. Our challenge is to use the gift of Elul, the last months of the old year, to prepare and enrich ourselves so we experience a truly meaningful new year. L'shanah tovah.